Hi, so you're about to see a pretty light-hearted video. It's pre-recorded and things aren't very light-hearted at the moment, so I just wanted to take this tiny little bit of time in the beginning to get some eyes onto a charity which I've donated to and I hope that you will consider doing. It's called SARI, which is Standing Against Racism and Inequality, and it's in inequalities of any sort. So if you feel the need, the link's there, and they work a lot with education too, so it's good to know that they're out there. Um, in the meanwhile, I do hope that you enjoy the video and I will, of course, appreciate any comments that you'll leave. All right, bye. Well, hi, we're about halfway through the week, so I am terribly excited. Again, the parcel's just around, so hang on there, I'll go get it. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun, dun. Bit of a Mickey Doo Dada. And oh yeah, I forgot to say, my name's Kay. Welcome back to my channel. Stick around, subscribe, blah 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 blah. Anyway, let's get it open. I'm so excited. All the things, all the things. So yeah, they had a bit of a sale on going, so we did look at the inside of this one. It's like, how cute that is. They even do cover boxes as well. How fun. And the whole cardboard box is like that, that's so cool. It said like, oh boy on it. Excellent, so, packing this, packing this stuff. So, I got this for my daughter. Packing box. Russell, Russell, Russell. And it's actually, how cute is that? It's a little close. So I've got her one for now, and then I've got her one for her birthday, or for other people's Christmas gifts. And I've got everything, as I buy one, get one half by, so I'm very excited. Now this, I did not get half by. I can't wait to wear it at work. I'm going to pop that to the side. It's a very big box. But this is my new, Start Enterprises Lanyard. So I can put my work class in there. And I've got, oh, excellent. Look, it's actually come with a pin as well. I'm going to put my pins on. So very excited. Of course, it's meant to be for the hubster um, or for the sun when we go to the parks, but it's got a nice clip on it too. So that's great. And that'll just nicely fit my work class in or my actual everything else. And, Oh, look how cool that is. Tony Stark, it's brilliant that. Oh, I love it. I love it. So, yeah, it goes with anything because it's black. So, it goes with my poo bear. Do you see my poo bear? Isn't that cool? Poo bear in here. So, yeah, Disney rocks on. So, the other ones are also from the Ink and Paint collection. And I'll let you into a secret. It's glasses. Not for like glasses on your face, glasses for the kitchen. I just need to get into it. I need to get into it. I need to get into it. Oh no, I've got my pencil. Which will never do. Gosh, they've used this as a firm brick. Well, hopefully it won't come back battered. So these were £23 only. So one was £23 and one was half of that. Oh, they look so cool. So again, from the incomplete range. Because I keep breaking all of my glasses. And I think the other ones are different, or at least I hope they're different. So, you see there? How cool are they? Come off, little sticky thing. Come off. first. Oh, lovely. We've got Sleeping Beauty first. Oh, she's got directions on her. White light beige. Oh, she's got like the ink and paint directions on her. So that is super cool. And then this one. Oh, Tinks. I have a little bit of Peter Pan. And this one. Oh, how cool is that? 
Mr. Toad. You very rarely see things that are Mr. Toad. So I'm very happy that we have Mr. Toad as it comes to the collection. Oh, and Bambi. Now, Bambi was one of the first movies that I went to see at the cinema, and I was actually quite old in all the other cinemas. I'd like to watch on VHS, all the other movies I'd watch on VHS. And um, when I saw Bambi, I was about 12, and my dad had let me go to the cinema by myself. And I had taken my little kiddie brother with me, so he was like nine. And of course, nobody had informed me at the beginning of the Bambi movie like every other Disney movie known to man it's quite sad and I'd also borrowed a kid from next door because I thought I'm a bit old for going to see Disney movies now I'm like that don't care if the kids are there but back in the day it was like not the you know it was Ferris Bueller's day off was out you should have gone and seen that not Bambi and so there I was and crying of buckets in the cinema because Bambi is so so sad yes so I'm very impressed with those they are going in to I wonder if you can dishwash them. I highly doubt it. I should wear my glasses. It says fragile. <laughs> um, I'm thinking probably not for the dishwasher. In fact, when we have a little look, I bet these mean when I've got my glasses on, don't dishwash them. So, probably don't even look at them. Don't microwave and no dishwasher, it says. I need longer arms or I need my glasses on one or the other. Let's get the other ones open. <laughs> We never dishwash our, our Disney glasses anyway because they're just too fragile. <sighs> so these were actually slightly more expensive than the other ones. I'm not quite sure why, but the the price difference is around three pounds. I don't know. That. So we have ink and paint collection again. Hooray! I'm so happy. Honestly, it, it, it's nothing like a good day, day's work to think I've got this to look forward to. I knew it was here because um, I was doing some work from home today and then I had to go back out to the office, um, back to clinic, and um, I knew it was here, so I didn't open it. I was like, no, don't open it, don't open it. Leave it, and the kids know better than to open Disney stuff. <laughs> you would think it was for children, wouldn't you? Let's see who we've got. So our first one, it's Jungle Book. It's Baloo. Oh, look how lucky. He... Oh, isn't he lovely? They've got the year on it as well, 1967. Um, and that's actually my mother's favourite Disney um, film. Oh, and Dumbo from 1941, apparently. And there he is, flying. I remember when I first saw Dumbo, I was a grown up actually when I saw Dumbo and I was showing it to my daughter and I remember thinking, I think the Imagineers might have been on some um, like marvellous medicine because there are certain bits of Dumbo which is very psychedelic. <laughs> oh, A Lady in the Tramp, one of my absolute childhood favourites. I did see this as a kid, um, absolutely loved it and I've seen the new one because I've got Disney Plus, of course I have. And yeah, absolutely love that movie. It's so, so nice. I love that it's got the directions on what colours they are. Oh, so nice. And then last but not least, who have we got? Oh, Alice in Wonderland. I mean, if you thought Dumbo was psychedelic, Alice in Wonderland and her Cheshire Cat is something else, isn't she, the caterpillar? But I do, uh, I do love the story of Alice in Wonderland, and I did actually Disney bound um, the whole family as Alice in Wonderland and we went over to Florida and we went and saw Alice and we got our picture taken so I might try and find that picture and put it in for you. So absolutely love, love, love this Disney stuff. So grab yourself, just put yourself on email alerts for Disney because they were literally, they were having a sale that day, it was ending at midnight and that was it. I think my favourites, what's my favourite thing in here? I probably think the toad glass, because you so rarely see toad blessing, you don't see him very often at all. Where are you toad? Hiding, hiding away. And that's that. So that's me, do like and subscribe and I'll see you